Hey guys, what's going on? Trouble here today. We're going to be playing some Farming Simulator 2017. Now, I'm going to be doing a few 17 videos to sh just to kind of wrap up the end of this little series here that we had before. And to see if you guys would like it more. If you guys want to see more of 17, let me know. I can record 17 and 19. Because I do still have it. Um, we basically went through off camera because I was trying to rush getting this all done but then 19 came out and I had to go to harvest and all that so basically the whole map is harvested except for the corn we don't have the corn done and this field now this field and let's see let's let's just jump to the farm here and as you may notice there's a fence here now the trees are there and the buildings going I had to convert back to the original map because for some reason the other map didn't work i don't know i kind of lost it so yeah we were binning them i think we have everything in the bin actually for beans pretty sure and we have our interrogator and a few tractors are missing because i pulled them out of the game and try to convert them to the other 19 try to convert them to 19 and the automatic water is gone but we're not going to be playing on this map much and if we are i'll probably switch to a different map probably go to Mississippi map, UMRV map, something a little funner, probably convert most of this equipment, just put it all in the same save game, because this truck and this trailer looks awesome, and the setup looks pretty good, so we have three grain carts over here, two big ones, and then we have the Steiger on the 1051, or 1050 grain storm, but yeah, if you guys want to see more of this, let me know, I can make more. Or if you just don't want to see it at all, let me know. So yeah, today we're going to jump in the semi and we're going to go through and sell all this. Now fields 3 and 4, if I can find my map, they have that valley in between. And I went ahead and edited the map so that it, all the trees were gone. Well now the trees are back because I'm on the original map. So it's kind of all messed up with that whole thing there. It doesn't really work. Like the trees are in the way and a bunch of other stuff are in the way. So it's, I'm going to pull in there and cut as much as I can out of it here shortly, maybe in another video. But anyway, we're going to pull the 379, I believe it's 379, Peter Bell out with this green trailer. The Wilson, good old Wilson, triple axle Wilson. I think you can lift the triaxle too. So that's neat. And then, yeah, so basically everything, all the beans are harvested. I'll probably just pick the corn, maybe and live stream the corn. Do some live streams on here on the corn. Just to kind of get it all finished up and gone. But if you guys want some more, let me know. Because I like, I think I might like 17 more than 19. But converting, like going back to 17, it looks kind of weird. Like everything's all different, the lighting's different. It's just crazy. We'll pull in here, go ahead and start dumping that, and yeah, so it's like when I first joined in the game, it was all weird, like the textures on the ground look like fake, kind of. It's funny how everybody was like, from 15 to 17, they're like, oh yeah, textures are good, you know, they look nice, and then from 17 to 19, they look just way better. So we got 100000 off that, it's not a bad paycheck. We actually were putting it all in the bin, I just went ahead and sold this bunch. We probably should have moved the combines first. A little bit of lag there. I'm going to check. Well, I'm running about 50, 40, 50 frames. Not terrible. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and take this truck. I don't know where to park the semis. Probably just park them on the road. I think we're going to dump everything today. We'll probably get the combines rolling in the field. We got three of them running. We did have a 20... No, not a 2288. What was that called? 8820 Turbo. John Deere. That thing's sitting over in the field. It actually got watered in. It's over there in that field where you have to cross the creek to get out, or you have to drive all the way across to another field. I'll probably just drive. I'll probably just leave it there. And as you can see, the pivot's all jacked up because the trees are back and all that. Oh, and that means my little grass patch. I know where I could park now, but I'd have to move the semis later because that means that the gates missing oh yeah that's a nice wide driveway there pull up in here pretty sure it's gone 
I deleted one of these gates or these fences so that I could drive through into this field so that I wouldn't have to drive all the way to the house but it's not there anymore but we can jump actually we can unload over the fence if we have to that means we have to drive all the way around to the bottom of the field down there to get in to harvest the field too I think let's pull it up along the fence as close as we can we, I think we'll, the augers will be able to reach over the fence. Shut that one off there. We'll jump in the... Oh, and this pickup looks weird, too. It's just different. Just going to take some getting used to. Here's our 65 and our little 720 gas. With our hay trailer. Got that. The Massey Ferguson Swather. White 145 workhorse. Razor 4-seater. 863 Bobcat, and here's the 8820 Turbo that I was talking about. When I changed the map over, this got jacked up and is like full of water. That's kind of cool. I kind of like to see. I wish like in Seasons mod, if like the spring springtime, it would like fill up like this because there's lots of rain and in the winter and stuff, like fill full like that. It actually like raise and lower the water because all of this is a giant water plane underneath here. If we had the uh, a tool to dig down into the ground there'd be that water plane there there's water underneath every map and then we got the wide front file 460 that was a five it's four and then we have the 4760 on the v800 wagon that's not in the field oh i guess we could have took that truck back and yeah i forgot we had grain in the grain cart oh well we can take this truck back we're not going to drive that other truck all the way back. We'll just take this one in, sell it, probably get about the same. I think the other trailer holds more, though. I think it was at 220,000 bushels. I know, it's a lot of bushels, but I like to kind of scale things up a little bit. Especially when you're by yourself, because, like, if I had 50,000, there would be three loads in this semi. Like, if the trailer held its original... Its original, uh like wait this trailer originally hold 50,000 and now it holds 150,000 liters so I'd have to make three trips for this one trip and yeah so you'd have to do that I believe this is a T800 pretty sure it is where are we from are we from North Dakota what's the trailer say the trailer have a plate nada nope so that one got 56,000 that ain't terrible it is coming down in price, I'm guessing. So we'll take this back to the little farm. There is a little bit of lag once in a while. Don't know what the deal is with that. Don't know if it's showing up on recording yet, because I haven't watched it. I don't think it'd be too bad. Anyway. I think it's just because I'm driving fast. And all the mods. There's lots. I have like three, four hundred mods. I think I might have more. Nah. I deleted them all once on accident. We'll swing in the field here. Plus, like the chopped straw textures take up a little more power resource wise. There we go. We'll just leave that run. The 380. Oh, yeah. And then we got this terrigator. Little floater. And the two pivots sprayer. Here's the challenger. Went ahead and put it on the big wagon. Put the big old four. Is it a 450? 450 STX Stagger on that. So here's a hundred, here's a thousand bushel. This this trailer should hold. Oh yeah, I have automatic unloading. Couldn't figure out why I was not dumping. There we go, we'll do that. 9230 CR9000, maybe custom modding. And that one's empty, we can probably move that one. Oh yeah, we'll fire this one up. Put the auger out. This is the 1050. It does unload pretty slow. That's why I just don't generally use it a lot. Because it just unloads kind of slow. And looks like we'll probably end up going to be full. Let's see. We'll fill this. I like this trailer because it actually, like, when you move, it actually, like, piles the grain where the spout is. Instead of, like, just spreading it over the trailer. Of course it does when it reaches the height that it can't go up anymore. But it's cool to load it like this. 
We can probably carry over some beans to the next field too. Um, but yeah, this is just kind of like an update video just to see if you guys want it. Um, figured I'd change some things up from seven or from 19, make a few 17 videos just to kind of number one to finish this off and just to kind of review it because we do have to finish this this series on here. We don't have to, but I'm going to. Just because I still want to play a little bit of 17, because I haven't deleted it yet. And maybe I might do a little bit of multiplayer with some mods or something. Don't know on that yet. We're going to actually park this here. We're going to jump in the truck. And we will take it in. Probably end up dragging that. So we'll take this in. Sell it real quick. And we'll come back. We'll take that, this truck, to the field. I don't know. For sure we're going to take a uh, thing up here and sell it quick. Okay, so we made it to the sell point. We made 53 off that one. We're going to swing around this way again. So we'll take this to the field, and then... Actually, we might just park it here. Real quick, jump into the Challenger. We'll take it to the new field. And then, yeah, so I didn't really do much this video. I'll probably call it quits. Around 10, 15 minutes, I like to do that. Just because, one, it gets more, more views, more people watch it more. I found out that if I make longer videos, a lot of people don't watch the full video. And I understand that because I don't actually... There's a little bit of lag there. It's weird. But when I do, like, watch other people's 30-minute videos on farm sim, it's kind of boring. But there's a little bit of lag. I don't know what the deal is with that. Maybe it's a tractor. Maybe it's something... Hmm, I don't know. But we're going to go ahead and take it up the road. This tractor does go 41 mile an hour, so it's a good, it's an awesome, awesome grain cart tractor. The looks on it, the front end of it, just looks sweet. I like this tractor a lot. I might convert it to 19, or I hope somebody else does. There is one out for 19. I haven't looked at it that good. Like, actually, like, drove it. I know the tires are different on it. So, yeah, I think we'll just park it in that field over there. As you can see, it's like the trees are going through the ditch and stuff. We're going to park it up here in this grass spot. There we go. Shut that off. So, yeah, like the trees and stuff. Like, this was all one big giant field. And then, of course, when it got deleted, the map got deleted and I had to replace it with this one. So, like, there's beans in the trees and that and the land's not level so i'll probably just cut as close as i can to the trees all the way around or i might might go in and try and find the older map on here and just try and delete it but anyway i hope you guys did enjoy the video if you did hit that like button and let me know if you want to see more 17 or more 19 because i can do both and we will see you all next time